A couple of weeks ago we did 7 games that take advantage of the PS4 Pro best. Today we're doing a follow up video on 5 games that should get PS4 Pro support. The games on this list may or may not get support for the Pro, however this list is for those games I believe should. To start off with Battlefield 4, a launch title for the PS4 in 2013 and a showcase for what the original PS4 could do. Battlefield 4 may be a few years old now but it's still a pretty good looking game, especially in a single player, however its biggest issue is aliasing due to running at 900p, bumping up the resolution to a native 1080p at the very least or preferably 1440p upscaled to 4K potentially would eliminate jagged edges that are quite apparent in the game, most notably in the multiplayer whilst keeping a good frame rate. Battlefield 1 received a pro patch that really sharpened up the game, so it would be nice to see Battlefield 4 receive some attention as it's still a great game and the best modern day era Battlefield we have so far. Next is The Witcher 3. The game released in the middle of 2015 and was arguably the best game of the year, winning many awards. The Witcher 3 received two large expansions, the final one out late last year. As is, it's a fantastic looking game, however upon release had some bad frame rate issues in certain specific areas that tax the console. This was remedied somewhat through patches however never hit a solid 30 frames per second. Thankfully PS4 boost mode with the newest update fixes this for the most part. Ideally if The Witcher 3 were to get a patch it would give the option of two modes. One to bump up the resolution taking the great already looking game and make the image even crisper or give us a nice absolute solid 30 frames per second if possible. The environments in the game are fantastic to look at, so imagining some of them with the addition of HDR would be pretty incredible. Sadly it doesn't look like such a patch will ever happen, as CD Projekt Red have confirmed they won't be releasing a pro patch. Still, it would be really awesome to see, and well, a man can dream, right? Assassin's Creed Unity released at the end of 2014 and didn't have the smoothest of launches, suffering a lot of performance issues that many described as unplayable. Performance problems and bugs aside, the game in my opinion is a rather good game. With the PS4 Pro 4.5 boost mode, we see the frame rate closer to the target 30fps more than ever. However, it would be really great to see a proper Pro patch that absolutely nails a solid 30fps and at least 1080p, or if and a big if here, hitting 1440p. Having the option to switch between the solid frame rate or a higher res would be great. Assassin's Creed Syndicate got a Pro patch which, although not the best one out there, would be nice to see the same treatment for Unity. HDR wouldn't be a bad thing either. Bloodborne released in 2015, a gothic, faster Dark Souls game from Hideo Taka and Miyazaki that fans laptop come launch. Bloodborne is a great game however it's also a game that relies heavily on absolute pinpoint accuracy and movement, meaning frame rate is more important than usual. When the game launched we saw some fairly consistent frame drops and judder. With the PS4 Pro boost mode we see that the frame rate drops less however judder still remains an issue, so ideally a pro patch would attempt to rectify this and thus making the game run a lot better. When it comes to the visuals, a bump in resolution would be great, however for this title I would prefer the performance benefits over the visual ones, so an option to choose which to prioritise would be best. This last entry is kind of weird as Overwatch does already have a pro patch, however despite how great the game is, its pro patch is one of the worst we've seen, virtually non-existent even. Currently the image quality remains unchanged at 1080p, with only the HUD and text sitting at 4K some higher quality texture filtering and improved depth of field which is rather lacklustre. The developers definitely could have done more, possibly pushing the game for 60 frames per second and 1440p which would have been a much better well received patch. Considering Overwatch isn't going anywhere anytime soon, it seems like the perfect game in particular on this list to create a proper patch for that can really do the game justice. Hopefully we'll see some improvements sometime in the future. That's it for today's video. Let me know if you agree with the games I've mentioned and what others you'd like to see supported. If you enjoyed the video leave me a like and sub which would help me out a lot. Click the thumbnail on the left to watch the 7 games that take advantage of the pro best and the thumbnail on the right to view my latest video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.